Hello everyone, this is Badar Boy and this is an owl. Yeah, she says hi. Well, or he says hi. I still don't know. Soon I will. Well, um, so uh, <laughs> I gotta talk about a little bit about birds. Yes, birds. So the birds that I had shown before prior in a video. Uh, it was not mine. I was bird sitting him between quotations. I was bird sitting him. Um, uh, he, he came with another birdie, but that other bird died on the way reach uh, on the way towards our home. We got we got both of them unexpectedly. It was unexpected, and why she why is she looking at me like that? Hmm. Well, we got it. We got them unexpectedly. One died. We tried our best to keep him alive, keep him warm, keep him hydrated. But I think his time was just up, so we can't do anything about that. It is an unfortunate uh, fact of life. So um, uh, that one died, and that one was supposed to stay with us. Uh, however, the other one didn't, and uh, we kept him for approximately four days until we had to bring him to uh, his owner. So basically, we got him from one guy, and we needed to keep him for a few days until we can deliver him to the other guy. And now that birdie is gone, it's uh, with his owner, I believe, he's living happily with his owner. But now, the same guy who actually got us the, 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 the two birds I was like you know what here's an owl and yeah here's an owl so um, if everything goes alright I, I, I'm going to keep to keep it oh look at her or look at him I don't, I don't know to be honest I kinda wish it's a it's a she and not a he I don't know why because I don't know why to be honest. It's just some because an owl in uh, the language, my native tongue, uh, comes out always uh, as a feminine, a feminine noun. So I'm kind of very used to saying she and her, even though I don't know if it's a male or female. Look at that sleepy little girlie. Um, we did put, uh, I well, we did put some meat for the owl in the cage. Because she eats, uh, according to the owner, she eats um, fresh, not fresh meat, she eats uh, not non-cooked meat. We have some in the freezer, we defreeze them for a while and then gave them. And under, any, under no circumstances should we give her water to drink because that will kill... This baby owl, and I do not want anything bad to happen to this lovely little creature that is a killing machine and can murder me if it flies outside the cage. And it flies, according to facts about owls, it flies um, without a voice. It's like, uh, it's almost, it's it, like she flies stealthily. You don't, you don't even hear her flying because... The um, the feathers are very soft, like the softest out of all birds. So yeah, this is the first night the owl is over here, and um, that's it. I also just wanted to say Happy New Year, everybody. <coughs> ah, sorry, the cold is gone, but the cough is continuing. It's still stuck on me. So Happy New Year, May. 2021 bring us um, a lot of joy and uh, may it be a lot better than 2020. And I know I've been uh, not uploading or streaming much lately. I am doing it whenever I can. However, uh, I'm under like a mess stressed right now from university and all. Um. Uh, like waking up at 5 a.m. to start studying 
until 6 uh, p.m. It's 6 to 7 p.m. It's really stressful. It's really tiring. I don't feel I'm even sleeping anymore. Uh, however, it, it doesn't really matter in the end. Uh, it matters the result. It matters, and it matters it of the hardships that you need to endure. Um, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I said Merry Christmas uh, because, uh, you know, out of habit. But considering that uh, Orthodox Christians haven't yet uh, had Christmas, they have Christmas on the 7th, so early Merry Christmas to my brothers and sisters who are Orthodox Christians, Eastern Orthodox Christians, and Happy New Year 2021, everybody. And, well, goodbye.